This is where on our 31 spooky movies of Halloween. I won't do that again. Yes, where? As in, where did the last 90 minutes of my life go? Where is a found footage narrative hybrid about a grisly murder in the French countryside and how a lawyer and her team defend the man named Talon, who the police say is responsible, who is either a werewolf or just a big sickly man who wants his mommy and a little sympathy from those who have disrespected him and his family for generations. Uh, what's that? He killed how many people? And he did what to a little boy? Ow. I'm just going to say it. This movie would have worked a lot better as a 100% found footage horror movie, or at least a mockumentary. As it is now, Ware starts out in a very interesting place as an investigative mystery, and it works until the moment that we learn that the man in question, spoiler alert, is actually a werewolf. And then it treads awkwardly down the path that countless other werewolf movies have trod before, ditching the found footage aesthetic for something more narrative, uninspired, and dull. The grainy and unpolished look giving way to something more detailed and in-depth, which does nothing but expose the flaws we didn't see before. And then the movie just gets redonkulous as it devolves into two werewolves duking it out in the countryside for a climax that is neither exciting or daring. Just dumb, cheap, and tacky looking. And it stinks because Ware started out so strong and ended with a resounding thud. Where? More like where did all of the promise go after the first half hour? To its credit, Brian Scott O'Connor is the best thing about this movie. A hulking behemoth of a man, he plays this part as half dangerous and half sad. Moreover, he strikes me as a man who's just tired. He's tired of it all, and when he asks for help, you believe him. This is a guy I can get behind. This is a guy we feel bad for. This is a guy we want to root for. This is a guy who... What's that? Oh. He senselessly killed how many people in a hospital? Wow. Well, I guess the movie wanted him to be a straight up bad guy. Can't sympathize with a beast too much. That's not allowed. Heck, even the suggestion that a bear might have killed the family at the beginning of the movie and not Talon is cast into the darkness of the movie not giving a darn because werewolf bad. I'm just so tired of movies like this starting out with so much promise and dropping it all when they lose their nerve. No movie, we don't want to see the same thing we've seen a million times before. I actually liked the investigation procurial that Ware started out as before it became an underworld knockoff. Where? More like, where am I gonna find a good werewolf movie? Am I right? This is getting exhausting. Hopefully I'll trip over something sooner than later, but in the meantime, you can put where on your list of 31 spooky movies of Halloween, because I'm not doing it. <laughs>